David says, so I have a single keyword branded term for a video used to rank for a single keyword branded term, a, a video used. Okay. Used to rank for, okay. For years, it completely dropped off, but the video still ranks for the branded term plus location or the branded term plus apartments, etc. I added some video SEO mojo and the two plus word terms ranked higher, added five high authority safe links and those keywords ranked even higher. Still not ranking for the single word term. Man, I, single word terms, I don't think I've ever even tried to do that. <laughs> so that's got to be tough, Damon. Just purchased 20 expired high DA tumblers and daily I'm adding either embeds or images and anchor text for the branded phrase. I also bought 22 SERP space links in the real estate niche. Okay, still not ranking for the main term. For years, the main term was ranking and I need to get it to rank again. I am baffled as to what happened. My next steps are update the content, hasn't been updated in years, add a hashtag and the NAP and run a press release with the NAP in it and modify the video date. I remember Chris, I think, noticed that old rankings of websites with the embeds were capturing old dates and tanking ranking or tanking rankings. Yeah, what Damon's talking about was um, Dr. or uh, I thought it was Gary. Yeah, I think it was Gary, that, uh, Dr. Gary, that actually was talking about that in the mastermind. Um, he did some testing on that. It wasn't until he and others re-embedded the video with the new embed code or the ch or changed the date that the rankings resumes, uh, resumed. Testing everything so far, no bueno. Any recommendations or hell no, nah. <laughs> don't do that. The channel is well-aged with plenty of videos too. No, I mean, it sounds like everything you got going on, Damon, is sound. Um, I, You know, my first go-to thing now is if I've tried every SEO trick up my sleeve and I can't get a video to uh, rank where I want it to, then, you know, the next thing that I always do, and, and, I'm, and I know you're aware of this, Damon, is I set up uh, ads, you know, YouTube ads and start driving traffic to there, especially if it's um, a local keyword that you're targeting because you can set the geographic radius or, or targeting, right? So geo-targeting and you can get I clicks from local IPs and that has a huge effect on local video um, is getting clicks from local IPs. And so here's the thing, if it's local, which it sounds like it is, um, maybe it's not, but if, if it is local, then, uh, you know, usually with, with, uh, YouTube ads, you can go like really broad with your targeting as far as topical or interest targeting. Um, like I don't even use keyword targeting. I would just use, uh, interest based targeting. Right. And I do that specifically because I want more clicks from I local IPs. And that's, that's all I'm really caring about. I don't care if the clicks are coming from relevant traffic sources or not. At that point, I'm looking for clicks from local IPs. And that's, uh, so I'll set my interest target. You know, I, I generally won't even use keyword targeting. I would just set radius targeting and then use like interest targeting. Um, you can use something like affinity audience targeting, but that's really, really broad and you'll get a shit ton of clicks very, very quickly. So you'd have to set your budget fairly low for that. Um, but you can get more specific with interest-based targeting. Um, and then, you know, and, and it, it ends up that it's somewhat relevant traffic as well as just locally relevant, right? Geographically relevant, which should help. All right. I'd, so, I'd like, I'd like to ask him a question. I'd like to ask when he says that he bought 22 SERP space links in the real estate niche, does he mean that he got 20, that he went into our video powerhouse embed network? He probably bought domains. I'm not sure, but. He might yeah, have bought the because nowhere nowhere in here do I see that he that he's even tried the the, the embed route. Yeah, well, and he if, should. Yeah, and if, mean, if he does go with, uh, sorry, so, sorry, but while I while I'm thinking about this, if he does go with a press release, which I saw that it's it's in his plans, try a press release service that will allow you to in, to embed a video. You might have to pay a little bit more. But I mean, you you could use the the the, the term that, that you're looking for in the press release, and you can mitigate that 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 branded anchor text with everything else that, that you're doing to to cushion it. I don't know yeah. if, if that makes sense, but I think that that's that's what I would. Well, besides RYS Academy, of course, I don't see how if if, if it's local and you're not doing the the the, the map. And, and and the iframe stacking and all that stuff that you can do uh, in RYS Academy. I don't see why not. Yeah, and I, that's the other thing, Damon. Is I mean, definitely. Uh, again, I said after all SEO tricks were used up, um, so that includes definitely do a drive stack, 
for the video too um, because that's very, very powerful as well. And then you've got that all those drive files that you can just hammer <laughs> and, and just push all the juice that you want to that one video through the Google files. So.